Previously on International Taste Station. Oh, that's a giant moth. That was a giant moth. Fuck off. And now, this. Welcome to International Taste Station. I'm Sir Molly Johnson. And I'm Patrick, Patrick O'Neill. And this week we're continuing our high school drinking adventures, and we're indoors. Why? Because our parents are cool and don't mind if we drink, so long as they know we're safe. Exactly. Earlier, when you weren't here to see it, we went down to the malt shop to talk to some kids and find out what's tops with the teens today. Then, we talked to our youth pastor, Pastor B, down at and he was kind enough to pick it up for us. But now we have to go meet him. I could do it. Well, it's no great white. Thank God. It tastes like beer, but it definitely tastes like 10% at the same time. Yeah. That's what it is. It's the 10%. It's weird. It's not bad, though. No. It, I don't think it'd be my go-to beer. No. It's definitely not a contemplative thing. I could see if your intention was to get drunk on beer, this would do it. It doesn't taste terrible. And it's strong. Needless to say, we're getting fucked up. Woo. That's actually really nice, though. It is really good. I'm surprised. But again, I don't like the fact of it being an energy drink and alcohol. It might be the crate of Blackfly prior or, or the <laughs> beer, but I, I don't really taste the alcohol. Nope. It's I don't just, taste the alcohol at all. It's very balanced. Ooh. Which, um... Our complaint with the the pop shop, by the way, I love your stuff, pop shop. Um, my complaint with the the hard pop shop though was the you were too aware of the alcohol yeah. and also the pop tastes a little flat. Yeah. This though, similar perfect, similar concept. It's great. It's perfect. Cold shot. All right. I really can't open this anymore. Hey, I pulled soup from a bag, okay? I was strong. I pulled soup from a bag. I just can't open a bag of crackers. Cold shot. Once I get these crackers open, Molson there we go. Molson Canadian Strong Beer 6% Cold Shot. I'm not really a fan cold of... Cold Shot? Yeah. I'm not really a fan of Molson, but, you know... I don't think whatever. I am either, but... Today's a day for discovery. Ooh, it's foamy. Smells like beer. Uh oh. <laughs> Smells like beer and tin. It tastes like beer. <laughs> I'm gonna have a second. Okay. <laughs> Let's see if it also tastes like beer. Okay. This is it good. It sounds be like beer. It's doing something. 
Is the card full? The card might be full. Fuck! You want to do this wine? What the fuck now? Did I just hear a yell from B deck? Fuck, probably. I'm starting to hallucinate auditorily. <laughs> Shit, it's open. Okay, hold on, where's my glass? Shit, it smells like wine. Because it is fucking wine, Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, you ready? We're gonna do this. Okay, that's oh, enough. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, I'm sorry. You can wash it here. It'll be fine. My poor lab coat. It's dead. No. Oh, this is bad wine. Wait, how do you get wine stains out of white? We'll figure it out. Don't worry. Okay. You can wash it here. All right, we're good. We're good. Shit. Okay. Fuck. Ah, oh, it's on my jeans. <laughs> that's on my popcorn. Motherfucker. Does that make a smart that let's, let's fuck this current show and just become a cracker show. Fuck yes. We could do all that kinds of That could be Thursday crackers. nights. Thursday nights we do crackers. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Thursday night cracker show on International Taste Station. I can't open these. <laughs> A saltine and two kernels of popcorn. It's perfect. The saltine is the perfect cracker. So to conclude, I don't think there's any losers this week. <laughs> Let me say. I I want to say. I want to say the winner, saltines. 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 Graphic. <laughs> So if you're a teenager looking to best spend your teenage dollars on a bit of booze, you can't go wrong with a saltine. <laughs> I think that's pretty much our conclusion. Well, I'm Mr. Molly Johnson. And I'm Patrick, Patrick O'Neill, and I'm fucking drunk. Goodbye. Later. How did I end up left with just... <laughs> oh, Zenith? Jesus! <laughs> Sorry, Still Alan. Put out. So last week we drank some high school classics, at least in the, the ghost of Helen Thick died of a heart attack playing hockey. It's the Canadian way. Is it Canadian? No. Yes. <laughs>